Well, standing out in the midday sun, looking at the ground beneath you for hours on end may not sound like a whole lot of fun to most of us, but don't tell that to nearly 1,000 students and young people that traveled to Oklahoma to take part in the 61st annual National Soil Judging Contest. Delia Davis explains. While land judging is not something you hear about every day, it is a national competition based right here in Oklahoma. The contest originated as a way to make it more interesting to teach students about soil, the importance of soil, and it was modeled in some ways after a livestock judging contest. Students from across America, as far as Hawaii and as close as just up the road in Adair County, come here to get down and dirty. Annie Kinsler is from New Mexico. Stains your hands a lot and it's real fine and it's really hard to make a ribbon out of. And for the students and teachers from all across the country, Oklahoma's red dirt offers some challenges. Texture's texture anywhere you go. Uh, you have, uh, compared to at least the soils in Yale County, we have a lot more coarse soils out here, really a lot more uh, uh, just different types of soils as far as the uh, variations. And uh, we have a lot of fines out here, and we don't have a lot of fine soil textures out there. And there are a few perks that come along the way. Honestly, getting out of school, <laughs> uh, beyond that, they do learn a lot. They enjoy the competition. The kids really like competition. But secondary, you know, they get a lot of good information out of this contest. There's a lot of it that it applies to real life situations, real life jobs out there. So they're getting a lot of valuable information and education from this contest. Giving these students a whole new appreciation for the land beneath our feet. <laughs> 